All right, Jeff Stanley here again with the four hour journey and uh, back at square one. Not exactly square one, but uh, restarting the four hour body. Um, I'll give a little bit of a refresher for anybody new to the channel. My name is Jeff Stanley. Uh, I started the four hour body back in 2010. By 2012, I had lost 160 pounds. January 1st, actually it's January 2nd. I started to record this yesterday and I didn't finish it. Uh, so I'm recording this as January 1st, 2019, even though it's January 2nd. Uh, and I've already recorded today for a second video in this new thing I'm doing. So uh, basically starting over January 2019, uh, I haven't gained all my weight back, but I have definitely gone up. Like I said, I originally lost 160 pounds. I went from right around 355 to 360, just depending on the scale uh, that I was on. And I went all the way down to about 192, 190, it was about 192, uh, it, which was for me a little bit too thin. So I came back up and I hovered probably right around 215 to 220 uh, for six plus years. So I had lost all the weight by 2012. It's uh, by 2018, so six years. Uh, I had maintained that. I'd gone up a little bit, just lifting weights and stuff like that. So I would go up to 220, 225 at the very most, uh, and then I'd kind of go back down. Really kept it within 215 to 220 for the most part of, uh, a better part of six years. And then by, uh, I'd say <clears throat> November of 2017, I started to go up a little bit. I was right at 225 again, and uh, just got into really bad habits. I mean, the, the diet was working for me. Once I actually lost my weight, I started to incorporate a few more things into it uh, on Tim's suggestion, which were things like sweet potatoes, brown rice, quinoa. Uh, I started to kind of add a little bit more, uh, brought some of the fruits back into it, uh, but I was really good about meal prep and following the diet. Uh, I didn't cheat too much. I still kept it to one day a week. Um, and then <clears throat> I'd say, probably right around November, it was Thanksgiving weekend. We usually do Thanksgiving weekend in Seattle. So uh, we were up there, of course, eating absolutely everything. And once we left uh, Seattle coming up into Christmas, the month after that, I really didn't put it back into check. So of course I gained a little bit of weight over that weekend because we were eating everything and uh, didn't put it back into action. So I ended up gaining a good 10 pounds. I went from about 225 to about 235 uh, by about Christmas day. And then again, didn't think too much of it. I'd been doing it for six years. Uh, I knew I would take it right back off. And then just kind of slowly uh, <laughs> kind of drifted from my plan that had been working for uh, six years. And then just slowly over the next year from basically Christmas or January of 2018 until now, I've put on an additional 40 pounds. So from November of 2017 to now, I've put on about 50 pounds. So that's about 14 months to put on 50 pounds, which is terrible. Uh, and I watched myself do it the entire time. I would go up another 10 and it start to kickstart the diet. And it just, I got real lazy. And it, I think one of the reasons I got lazy was uh, I started to do other things. I still had meal prep. Uh, the gym was a, a big focus. I've never stopped going to the gym, but when I would come home at night, I do another thing. You can see behind me candles. I make candles as a side business. So I started to put a lot more focus into that. And then I started to drop some of the things like meal prep. Uh, and if you've watched any of my videos, you know that meal prep for me is key to everything I do. So at some point I started to get lazier and lazier with the meal prep and it eventually just led into the pitfalls that any diet when you fall off, off of a do. If you're not prepared for it, uh, you're just going to fail. And that's exactly what happened to me. I knew exactly what to do. I knew exactly how to diet. I mean, I've been doing it for six years. I know exactly what I need to do. I know my body extremely well now. I know what I can and can't eat uh, to lose weight and maintain weight. And I just wasn't doing it. So. I'm back here now, 50 pounds up, and uh, I, it just, it, I need to get it back off. So that's exactly why I'm here again, putting this out here. And uh, just basically, I'm gonna try to film every single day, and I've already failed at that. I started to film yesterday. Uh, actually, I filmed yesterday, I just didn't upload it. So I'm gonna try to film and upload, even if it's only a minute. 
I'm gonna try to do it every single day. Uh, at least for the first 30 days. Uh, Tim made a post the other day on the Facebook page talking about losing 20 pounds in 30 days. So I think I can do 25 in 30 days, so that's what I'm gonna go for. I think 25 is doable for me, especially with me being up. I could definitely go down further than 50 pounds. I'm not gonna do 50, 50 pounds just because uh, 225 for me uh, is a pretty good weight. And right now I'm at right around 275 to 276 which is unbelievable. I can't believe I'm up that high again, but here we are. Uh, I've got a video I shot yesterday that shows me jumping on the scale, so I'll play that here. All right, so we're running upstairs. I'm gonna weigh myself. Today is January 1st, 2019. Uh, let's see where we're at. All right, so it's probably about 12.30 right now. Uh, I've already been to the gym, I've already eaten, so that weight is up a little bit, but we're gonna go ahead and put that uh, right up here or right up here, and uh, the goal is 50. Here, and then that, I think that said, t I, I need to watch it again before I, <laughs> I think it was 276.8, uh, but basically 276. So I'm gonna get back down, get back down to 225. Uh, if I went lower than that, I, it's not a huge deal. I, I like being at 220, but 225 is a good weight for me. Um, as I start to go lower than that, I start to lose a lot of features in the face or more features are exposed, which I actually don't like. Uh, so 225 is the goal. I'm hoping to be at least 250 by January 31st. So we're gonna go from January 1st to January 31st. Uh, try to do this every single day. And then after that, <clears throat> I'm still gonna document and kind of vlog the whole thing uh, and go down the rest of the 25 pounds. But I'm shooting for the 25 for the first 30 days and uh, we'll just kind of go from there. Now for this next go around, uh, I, I'm basically getting back on the four hour body uh, 100%. Uh, I've already started to do meal prep. Uh, and for my meal prep, if you've watched any of the previous videos, I usually stick to chicken, refried beans, and broccoli, cauliflower, something like that. And then uh, I do like cottage cheese, stuff like that, eggs, turkey bacon. Uh, and I don't mind eating those things. I found recipes that work for me, so I usually stick within those, and I can eat those every single day, and I never get tired of them. And like I said, I've already gone and done a lot of the meal prep for this, so I've, I'm getting everything set so that I can basically put myself in a path to success. So that's pretty much it. I, I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do. I'd like to kind of vlog this whole thing. I have my GoPro that I take with the gym so I can kind of film that stuff. Plus it's easier to, to kind of update and vlog on that thing throughout the day. Uh, the audio on it isn't that great. Uh, and then on the weekends, I'm gonna use this camera to do like a full weekly update. Uh, and then I've already begun, begun taking pictures, uh, taking pictures obviously with the shirt off and everything like that. I don't know how much of that I'm gonna put on this just cause I'm never comfortable with that. But uh, it, it, I'll get up and do like full body shots and uh, just so that I can track progress through the entire thing and uh, just basically document every single day and this loss again. I, so that's pretty much it. I'm gonna watch this one back. I know there's a bunch of things I glossed over uh, and I'm gonna update those in the, uh, the videos that are coming in the days following. So that's pretty much it. 276, back down to 225, and uh, I, we're shooting for 25, uh, 25 pounds at the end of January.